To Latin America now, Venezuelan President Nicolas Maduro has again offered an open and unconditional dialogue with the United States, but he says he will only accept a dialogue if it is on equal terms. Venezuela is ready for a dialogue with President Barack Obama on the basis of respect and on terms of equality between the states, wherever, whenever, and in any way he wants. I say so as President of the Bolivarian Republic of Venezuela. We are ready. If President Obama wants to shake this hand, that of a Venezuelan, of a patriot son of Bolivar, son of Chavez, I am ready to shake his hand, to talk and look into his eyes on equal terms. The Executive Secretary of the United Nations Economic Commission for Latin America and the Caribbean, Alicia Barcena, has praised Venezuela for its efforts to eradicate poverty. Barcena was in Venezuela at the invitation of President Nicolas Maduro. She visited working class communities in Caracas to familiarize herself with the social programs of the Venezuelan government. And support continues to grow for the campaign to repeal President Obama's executive decree that declares Venezuela a threat to the U.S. national security. By late Thursday, more than 4 million signatures had been collected in Venezuela. Beginning this Friday, teams will be going door to door across the country to seek support. The campaign is also underway in dozens of other countries.